Before we get started, I'd like to give you a quick primer on user experience, or UX. The term UX, the term user experience, was coined by a gentleman by the name of Jesse James Garrett. He wrote an excellent book called The Elements of User Experience. If you don't have this book, you should go get it right now because uh, it is essentially the Bible of this profession. Anyone who's ever practiced UX in any way owes a great debt to the work that this man did. He defined uh, the model that we all follow. All right? And this, what you're looking at right here, is that model. Garrett came up with five planes of user experience. Strategy, scope, structure, skeleton, and surface. And the idea is that no matter what you're building, any type of digital product, okay, it started with websites, obviously, but enterprise systems, apps, anything, essentially follows this model in that all five of these things have to be included and considered in order to create something that's useful, usable, and valuable, all right? So we'll walk you through each plane real quick. In the strategy plane, we are thinking about user needs and business goals. What do people want from this? What do they expect from it? And what does the business need to get in return? Okay, are we talking about making money, saving money, uh, gaining efficiency of some kind? What is it, right? We move to scope, which is requirements and specifications. What are we building? What functionality is included? Um, and how much of it needs to be included? And what can we realistically do, okay? From there, you go to structure, which is information architecture, content. How much of it is there? How is it organized? How is it prioritized? How are people going to you know, move through it? What's it going to be called? What's it going to be labeled? From there, you go to skeleton, which is now we're thinking about navigation. How do people move through all this stuff? Uh, and how is it segregated into screens or workflows? Um, the layout of each individual screen, we're iterating that. We're trying to figure out how much will fit <laughs> on one screen and how much should be on one screen, okay? Wireframing happens here. From there, we get to the surface plane, which is final visual UI design, styling, fonts, colors, images. This is where everything becomes very real, okay? It's the part that people see. The way this works is that when we start out, again, no matter what you're building, you start out at a very abstract level, okay? You don't know what you don't know. Your work from here to here is defining that. What is it? What should it be? What could it be? Uh, and how are we going to do it? When you get up to the top, everything is now very concrete. It's real. We can see it. We can interact with it. Uh, and hopefully, <laughs> it makes sense to us, okay? So as you move through any project, this is what you're doing. You're starting with an abstract concept and you're working towards making it real. That's exactly what we're going to do in this course. From start to finish, I'm going to take you through the strategic aspects of deciding what makes sense for a website all the way through to what lives on the surface and actually designing and coding it. Okay? Let's get started.